what did Christian say originally when considering joining my coach's development course? Because this is back well before there was any thought of box ownership here, at least. I know you wanted to do it. But again, knowing you guys and your budget and frugality, what was that like? And then how much does he say about me? Like, what does he say about me on a regular basis? Okay, well, first of all, he mentions daily that he has to text you. So He texts me an absurd amount. He texts me more than Roz or my mom. Yeah, so it's a daily thing that he has to send you a text. <laughs> so your name is regularly mentioned in my house. Am I one of his favorites on his iPhone yet? Probably. All Not right. yet, but now that you say that, I might as well. <laughs> um, It'll go with the picture I have of you on my nightstand. <laughs> but um, when he wanted to do the coach's development course, he was kind of like him hawing about it. And he said he really wanted to do it. Like it seemed very valuable and blah, blah. And I just, I told him, I'm like, just do it. Like I'm no stranger to paying for coaching because if it's something that you want to do and you want to get better at it, you need a coach to get you there faster. I mean, sure. You could figure it out on your own. You could go on CrossFit's website and like weasel your way to being a better coach. But if you really want to be a better coach, just hire a coach to help you get there faster. So for me, it was a no brainer. Like, yeah, get in this group, be better. You want to be a level two, you want to be a level three, you want to get on seminar staff. So do it. And like, that, that was easy for me. And then like, even for affiliate you, we reached out immediately when we knew we were going to buy the gym because it's like, we want this to be the best gym that we can possibly make it. And we can't do that on our own. So that's why we're in affiliate you right now too. 